This is the um, this is the wiring end of this uh, large air core coil, and I took I took the transistors out because I was trying them in parallel with steel wire as a uh, bridge, and um, I kind of burned them up. So anyway, this is the base, and I've got two wires here because I go to both transistors. This is the emitter tie, and the uh, Collector is tied to this metal. Picks up on the transistors. So, here's this Phillips bulb. I've got an amp meter. A 12 volt. It's pulling 36. No amps, no transistor. That's the dim. It's all a switch here. It cuts out one of the high voltage coils, so now I'm running at 13 milliamps. It is blinking. And that runs at about 89 hertz consistently. So what I found out is there's a slight short between my base and my collector somewhere and I can knock it out and the bulb will go out. But still I think it's interesting that this runs. Yeah there's a short, a 9 ohm short somewhere in there. That's probably why I blew my transistors. So that's what it was. So no, no power. Now, if I touch the base to the collector, bulb comes on. So I think that's kind of interesting. We're drawing. Okay, now I'm not touching. That's kind of weird. <laughs> I'm not, not touching the base to the collector anymore. Just started it. Around 36. Anyway, so it is. It's pretty interesting. I'll show you the battery voltage. It's around. It's around 12 and a half to 13. Actually, voltage is 13.36 uh, on that little battery pack. I think it's interesting. This dimmer switch still kind of works. There's the three coils. I'll show you Hertz. Okay, there I'm set on Hertz. Well, it's right around 90. 90 Hertz. Alright, this is the little Bettini motor and what I'm going to show you really doesn't mean anything. It's just kind of fun. So, this uh, is going to feed the flyback high voltage to the large air core coil powering these uh, two LEDs. So we'll hook it up to the 12 volt. And give it a little hand spin. Adjust it a little bit. Pretty fun. The only problem with this is those LEDs don't feed back, so this thing puts out too much power. It's basically, I gotta I gotta cut it off before I blow the bulbs up. This is just running the 3 watt LED.
Anyway, all, all this is is an oscillator. It's basically just uh, cutting the DC into pulses. And the wheel going around is for entertainment value. It could be done with a... I feel like it could be just done with this transistor here. This uh, varies the uh, resistance from uh, 150 down to about 60. So I'm lengthening the pulses now. Just drive more amperage. 